this month's TV 47 Star Student of the Month. So Wakanda Parks and Recreation Department Star Student of the Month from uh, Fayetteville High School is Madison White. Madison, good morning. Good morning. Good to have you with us today. And, uh, you know, you're a senior at, at uh, Fayetteville and just... Uh, couple of months to go before you graduate. Yes, sir. I'm very excited. I bet you are. Tell us a little bit about your family. Well, I have my mom, my dad, and then I have an older brother. His name's Logan. Okay. Now, what are your mom and dad's names? Jennifer and Joseph. Okay. Now, uh, you got any pets? I do. I have a dog. His name is Shop Dog. It's what? Shop Dog. Oh, okay. He was actually a stray, and he always like was around our shop. So we just named him Shop Dog. Shop Dog. Yes. <laughs> All right. Uh, tell us a little bit about being a senior at Fayetteville this year. You know, it's kind of bittersweet. Mm -hmm. You know, we, um, we're like a family at Fayetteville and a lot of the kids I grew up with. Like yeah. we've been, I've been at Fayetteville since I was in kindergarten. So I have, you know, all of the kids that I see every day are like my brothers and sisters. What, what makes Fayetteville such a unique community? just because it's so small mm -hmm. so we're like a family and like if you ever need anything the teachers are always there for you and yeah. like there's one miss robertson she is always there anything i need she was actually my cheer coach this year too oh, and wow. she's just always there for everything uh, senior at fayetteville with a 4.0 gpa now yes, do we need to get counseling for you or something uh, or, uh, maybe. that is fantastic maybe. <laughs> so you. how do you accomplish all that you know, it's all about time management. Mm -hmm. um, I'm in every club at Fitball also, <laughs> and I'm also the president of every club at Fitball. So it's a lot, but I, I manage it. It's all about the time management. You know, my grades always come first. Uh, you rank number one in your class. Yes, sir. I am. How many uh, seniors are in the class? I think there's 46 wow. of us. Way I think to go. So. Way to go. Thank what, you. What drives you, um, uh, Madison, to success? My mom. Oh, ah, well, she's right there. Yes, she is. But actually, when I was in like fifth grade, I wasn't even on the reading level. And that really, like, wow. made me so upset. And so it really drove me to perfection. So, yeah, fantastic. Now, yes, sir. Uh, Child care services. You love kids, right? I do. I actually want to be an elementary school teacher. Oh, really? Yes, sir. And then I tutor. So I get to be with kids after school. And then I also do babysitting in the summer. So well, You're around kids all the time. Then, I you? am. I love them. I bet you do. Now, talk about the tutoring that you offer. Well, I do all different grades. I've tutored middle school before. I haven't tutored any high school yet, mm -hmm. but I've tutored middle school and elementary. I actually want to be an elementary school teacher. So, you know, that's my forte, but we just do all kinds of stuff. All right. How important is it, especially for younger kids, that their nutritional needs are met? I think it's very important because if you don't have that first, you know, if you don't have that set up good, then I feel like they're not set up for failure, but if you set that up perfect, then they are definitely set up to succeed. Yeah. Do, do you see a lot of uh, need in our community for that type of service? I or think is it pretty a, well taken care of? I think of? there's a lot of need, but I think yeah. it is very well taken yeah, care of. Yeah. All right. Now, uh, being a senior, you talked about the clubs. Talk about a couple that's kind of spotlighted in your life. Well, I have a trip coming up with FBLA. I'm the president of it, and we're going to Mobile, Mobile, and um, we're going to have the FBLA convention, so that's going to be super fun. And then we do um, Key Club, which we haven't really got to do that much in my clubs mm -hmm. this year mm -hmm. because, you know, the whole COVID thing, the restrictions are still yeah. there, which is kind of sad for me because it's my last year, but we're doing what we can. Uh, we're talking with Madison White. She's a senior uh, at uh, Fayetteville High School, and she is a fantastic student and uh, got a great career ahead of her. And I, I noticed uh, that you're uh, on the uh, uh, varsity bowl bowling team. Now, my grandson's 11. He'll be 12 in April. Yes, sir. He went on his first bowling trip Saturday with the youth, uh, kids from the church. Yes, sir. And he bowled in three different lanes all at the same time. Oh, that is 
so yeah. interesting. Yeah, he just, he just threw the ball and it went two or three lanes over and all that kind of stuff. That actually happened one time in a match, not to me, but to another girl. Yeah. So talk about your, your bowling team. <clears throat> well, it's a lot of fun. We're not number one, but we have a lot of fun and we know how to lose. So that, you know, that's yeah, good. It's, We're it's, not sore losers. Right. We still have fun. And I think that's the most important part of any sport. Now, you're the captain of the varsity cheer squad. Yes, sir. I'm actually the captain of the bowling team, too. Oh, wow. Yes, sir. But um, I love cheer. I'm actually coming back this summer to go to their cheer camp because I never want to leave. Mm -hmm. But it's so much fun. And I think the group that I had this year, I'm so thankful for them because I think it's the best group that we've ever had. We have so much fun. Wow. Uh, you talked about the FBLA and uh, Future Business Leaders of America. And, and uh, you know, that's something that uh, is so important to building uh, yes, a young person, getting ready for the real world. Yes, sir. I think it is. I think um, the things that we learn in it, especially... Like, I'm president, so, you know, I do the meetings, and I get to lead the meetings. And I think it's a great experience. That way, you really, I really learned this year how to listen to everybody's mm -hmm. opinions. So, talk about uh, some of the courses you're taking your senior year. Well, actually, I'm only enrolled at two at Fedville. <laughs> And then I have my other two at Alabama through the early college So, how program. many hours a day do you go to school? I go to 1130, okay. but I have like a free period, first mm -hmm. period, and then I have AP Calculus, and then I take History, mm -hmm. and then after that I have another study hall, and then I go home and work on my Alabama okay. classes. Who's some of the teachers at school this year? Well, my AP Calculus mm -hmm. teacher is Miss Reed. Shout out to her, because mm -hmm. if it wasn't for her, I don't know if I would still be in the AP Cal class. <laughs> And then I have Coach Reed, and he's always makes history fun. Yeah. So, but those are the only two I have. And there's also like Miss Holly and Miss Ponder. And I think I wanted to mention Miss Igo. She has helped me tremendously for college. You know, they always say college is not like high school, and it's not. The tests, the way she done her tests, everybody. We did not do good on them. <laughs> but it's because it's like college. Yeah. That's how the college tests are. You have to really apply the knowledge that you're learning. Speaking of college and universities, what does the future hold for you? JSU. That's where I plan on attending. I'm very excited for it. I actually already have my roommate. All right. Yes, it's so much fun. and um, You'll be going away from home. Yeah, but not very far. That's true. That's the big reason I did choose JSU, because mm -hmm. I didn't want to be far. I wanted to be, you know, an hour and 30 minutes away yeah. from home. Yeah. Uh, being a leader uh, in your school and, and a senior that will graduate uh, coming up in just a couple of months, uh, how do you encourage other kids? I mean, obviously, you, you've got your life together. You've been very successful and, and uh, you know, top of the food chain as far as uh, organizations are concerned. How do you encourage other kids that they can do the same? I just always make sure that they're their self, and I think that is the most important part of it. And I always encourage them to take a break. Mm -hmm. You know, it's, mental health is everything for this kind of stuff, especially for me. And they've helped me learn that also. I, it's just, it's okay to take a break. And that's what I like to encourage. Do your best and that's all you can do. You can't change it after it's done. So do your best and let it go. Wow, fantastic. Madison White, who is a senior at Fayetteville High School, 4.0 GPA, ranked number one in her class, completing her high school diploma with an advanced endorsement. What does that mean? That means that I've took two AP classes and two foreign languages okay. over my high school career. What's the foreign languages? Like Spanish or French. I did Spanish 1 through Access at Fayetteville, and then I did Spanish 101 here at CAC. Wow. If I can capture English, I'm okay, much less Spanish or French. I know. I struggle uh. too. <laughs> I had a great teacher, though, at CAC, Miss Blair, Na Naomi Blair. Mm -hmm. She was great. All right. Hey, before we go this morning, uh, uh, how would you, why do you want to be remembered uh, as you grace the stage and receive your diploma for graduation in a few months? Did you say how? How would you like to be remembered at Fayetteville? A hard worker, for mm -hmm. sure, and uh, always a smiling face. I always try to encourage everybody. All right. And I think that's it. Yeah. <laughs>
All right. She is Madison White. Uh, uh, Alyssa, is that right? Yes, sir. Okay. Do you go by Alyssa or Madison? Madison. Okay. Madison Alyssa White, a senior at Fayetteville High School, and she will be attending Jack State University, and she wants to become an elementary yes, sir. school teacher? Yes, sir. Now, what's so special about those elementary kids, by the way? Well, like I said before, I've tutored all the different grades, and I feel like I had the most impact on the elementary. Mm -hmm. And I also feel like that is a very important foundation for them to have. So I feel like if I can get in there and really teach them the basics for what they need, it'll set them up for success. All right, here she is, ladies and gentlemen. Great smile, wonderful attitude. Madison Alyssa White, senior at Fayetteville High School. Madison's our star student of the month.